tonight I got Sunday here and that means I'm with my mom and uh, basically uh, I'm gonna show you how I get ready every day it's pretty simple it's pretty quick uh, I use very few products and generally just like to keep it simple so first for my eye cream I am using the Sinaki B Lano Pearl right here it's an eye cream I love it so much it's really great for those who have dark under eye circles uh, next I use the Kiehl's clear corrective clearly corrective dark spot solution so after the pregnancy I uh, you know I noticed lots of uh, pigmentation on my skin so for that I'm using this and just a couple of drops every day and um, I apply it where I feel that you know I've got some pigmentation and dark spots from the pregnancy uh, what's the name for it I think there is a name for that and um, I think it's working really great so far my skin has been great uh, next up and uh, Ellie has joined me now I use the rebirth uh, anti-wrinkle cream again Australian and I really really like it it's really rich creamy and uh, it keeps my skin moisturized the whole day. Yeah. No, Ellie, no, 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 no. So I will just apply that. Uh, so next, I always use a <clears throat> my MAC Pure Orange, uh, you know, Pro Corrector. It is very, very orange. Uh, looks like that. But this is just because I think I don't sleep well, uh, you know, with a baby. And uh, so I do get these dark circles. So I just try to correct them by applying this really orange corrector. I think this is best for Asian skin uh, when you have dark circles. Next, I use, again, MAC NC42. A corrector I've hit pan on this one <clears throat> and uh, I use my fingers because I feel it's the best for me it warms the product and applies you know really well so I'm just dabbing this onto my skin Next, I take my favorite favorite Laura Mercier uh, Secret Brightening Powder. I use it with a uh, beauty blender. I just put dab some in and there. And I actually just set the concealer. Uh, I'm not baking or anything, just lightly dabbing it on to set everything. And this is what I really do every single day. Now the foundation, I do not wear a liquid foundation every day. I find it very time consuming. I don't think I need the coverage uh, every day. So what I go for is a Studio Fix from MAC. The C, I'm using NC35, but I normally use the C2 or the C4. So that's what it looks like. It's a powder foundation. Uh, Sigma brushes are my favorite, favorite brushes. I love this brush. It's just round, very dense and I buff the product into my skin. So let's do that. I don't like wearing heavy makeup day to day because I think um, it's just putting so much on my skin. So that's it for my uh, foundation. I do like uh, a contoured look, but uh, uh, very light for day to day. So I do like to use a contour, uh, a very light contour for day to day. And I use the Makeup Forever 
bronzing powder for as one. Uh, I'm using a MAC brush with this. And just dust a little bit on the hollows of my cheeks. Mm, a little bit under the chin. A bit on the forehead. Still keeping it really, really, you know, clean and yeah. Next up, I will uh, use my eyeliner. I, I only apply eyeliner in the inside of my lid on the waterline uh, for every day because I don't like that heavy look for um, every day. So I do use, you know, the eyeliner liquid on the top, but only if I feel like on a, if I'm, you know, going out or lunch or something like that. But for my day to day, this is what I usually just wear. Uh, then I will wear my mascara. I think mascara is so, so important. And currently loving the Clarins. I love this. And I think it's just great. It's really black. And... Uh, I don't even need to use, you know, false lashes for this. Uh, it does a great job. It wears beautifully. So try it out, guys. And I will put some to my lower lid. Oh, I forgot. I forgot. Um, another thing I really, really like doing is going in with the same bronzer that I used. I take a small pencil brush and I actually line under you know my lower lash line just to give it a kind of a depth there. I really like how it looks. I'm loving brown right now, a lot of brown. Yeah. So next I'm loving the Coral Esther by Benefit, the blush. It's a really really nice peachy orangey tone. Uh, I'm using this every day actually for the last month and I just use the brush it comes with. This brush works, you know, just in the apples of my cheeks, on the high points, I'll put it there, a little on my nose, who else does that? And there. We go, I'm not going to use a highlighter, I don't use a highlighter from day to day, so that's no. The last thing I usually do uh, are the brows because it's so time consuming. So I got the Benefit Give Me Brow this one and uh, sometimes when I'm in a hurry I just use this on its own but today I may just go in with my Anastasia Brow Wiz pencil yeah yeah so it comes with two sides one is the spoolie and one is the product uh, first thing just comb my brows out really really fast guys it takes me literally like five minutes to do my whole face on a day to day what I've started doing more is line the top lid, fill in the sparse areas, you know, the bald spots. And I don't think my the shape of my eyebrow is really great right now. But we will make it work. We will make that work. So I'm just going to fill that in very, very fast. And see the difference? Okay. Next one. This is my difficult brow. I always uh, mess this one up, but they always look different. It's fine. They say eyebrows are supposed to look like sisters, not twins, so that's fine. But brows give me life. Brows, oh my god. I have this really sweet friend, and if she does your brows, you are going to want to move in with her. Like literally okay see I told you this brow it just never cooperates oh. oh god and you know what guys you guys should, should never never do you know those skinny brows oh my god those brows are so scary you know those witch brows never never do them those really skinny ones and I'm still seeing people wearing those brows 
so there it is uh, what I do after sometimes I do fill it in with a MAC uh, eyeshadow this is brown by MAC it's a really dark brown with cool undertones I'm using a brow filler brush this is from Sephora it's really tiny really cute the bristles really firm so just go in with that a bit and I fill the outer edges a bit just to hold that Anastasia brow with pencil and uh, whatever's left on the brush I just kind of comb through the front and there guys we have it loving this liquid lipstick by Anastasia as well it's Ashton uh, the color is so nice I'm in a hurry I'm not gonna like my lips hmm. And there you have it. And there it is. I am ready, guys. That took me no effort at all. Five minutes. You guys enjoyed it. Lots of love and like. It's going down and we are huge Tottenham supporters so my Tottenham shirt uh, just seven for mankind jeans my Chanel espadrilles and I don't feel like doing a belt and uh, that's it <laughs>